Quick pass. Kelsey's got a catch. Got a pickup of about four. I want to screen him, play action, and run it. You've seen the screen working already. Looking, diving under the first wave. It's the hole as you wash everything down on this side. This is what Kansas City did the last two weeks. They switched from the regular season, Jim. They went big personnel, 13, which means three tight ends, and they pounded the run. You're going to find it's right here, and he's going to take a great inside move, and that creates the ability. Houston did not have a single snap inside the 25. Here's Kansas City from the 19, throwing at the goal line, and it's caught by Kelsey for the touchdown. With Kyle Hamilton all over him, the matchup you wanted to watch, Kelsey wins it, and the Chiefs drive for an opening touchdown. And this was the matchup that I thought would be as instrumental as any to who wins. That's the first time a tight end has scored on Kyle Hamilton all year. Now, he has not seen the... He's, he's played everyone, all the greats. He has not given up anything this year to tight ends. 50-some yards all year, and what a throw. And tight ends don't have that kind of body control very often, Jim. That's rare. Wow, it's just something watching those two tangle and angle and fight for position and Kelsey makes a tremendous play for his third touchdown in the last two weeks it's now this is his again sixth championship game he's got six touchdowns drive now in eight consecutive postseason games Kelsey delivers on fourth down and then delivers the touchdown Gonna go up top for it, just lobs it right over Hamilton, and they have the first down with Kelsey's fourth catch. By the way, the Kelsey touchdown, his sixth, as we mentioned, in six championship games. That number six touchdowns, most by any player in history in championship games in a career. What a career, and great job by him here to make it look like he was going to block inside. Kelsey and Hamilton right here. This is the matchup. You're expecting man when they're aligned together. Mahomes back pedals to the 37. He's got time. All kinds of time. Now escapes. Fires it at the last second. And Kelsey caught it. Oh my gosh, that was amazing. Mahomes takes a wicked shot while releasing the football, but you're thinking it's a throwaway or something negative is going to happen. <laughs> and out of nowhere, Kelsey comes flying in. And what a start to this game for Travis Kelsey. I mean, he's made some catches. The touchdown catch wasn't easy. That one right there. Oh. <laughs> it's back to Pacheco. Pacheco drives across. Watch the left side of this offensive line move all those guys into the end zone jim and create that hole and then kelsey takes on queen and that was a big block for them huge and this is him there with chris jones second and seven kelsey has just tied the jerry rice reception record for career catches in the playoffs that's that's wow that's like not even a thing i thought anybody could touch i never jerry thought rice has yeah, exactly. numbers that you can't best of all time there and that's what kelsey's trying to do but you already talked about the most touchdowns. Yeah, in a championship, championship game, which he set today with six. But right now, Kansas City's doing that to them. Look at this. The direct snap to Pacheco, the fake to Rice. And that wizardry only adds up to about a yard. What a formation. Hold on a minute here. But they had Kelsey and Pacheco lined up. Kelsey is blocking outstanding. Look at him right here. He's really taking on an approach. Fourth and a foot. Pacheco, I don't think he got there. Hamilton came up. I'm telling you, this is as difficult a team to get a foot or a yard on. They've done it twice. But after you did it last time, you're going to try it again. I think his knee is down. Hamilton comes in from behind the knees down there. That's going to be short. Ravens ball. Ray Lewis's favorite player. Mm. He goes on and on. He says he just loves watching 14 play. Third and 10. Again, a low snap. Here comes Hamilton. Mahomes just has to unload it as Kyle Hamilton. It's like there are two or three of them out there. To me, 
Your ability to time the blitz is one of the most important things. He doesn't show it. He doesn't show it. He doesn't show it. And then all of a sudden, here he comes. And Mahomes is as good at anybody at figuring out who's coming. For a moment lined up across from him. Switches to the other side. First and ten. Out of the backfield. Pacheco is trying to get a running start. But who else? Hamilton brings him down. But the clock what a run. play by Hamilton. Mm -hmm. he, he was on the opposite side, Jim, and took off yeah. like a rocket. Second and seven. Mahomes down the field, wide open. It's Kelsey again, who's having just a monster first half. Picks up 21. Mahomes does an excellent job of getting the protection to come out. You got a guy inside, but that's going to allow the O-lineman to get the blitzer and the area where he blitzes from, that's where you throw the ball, Jim. You leave an area, you throw it to that area. Kelsey's as good as anyone at finding that soft spot. Timeout called by Kansas City. Working on a drive here in the closing minute of the first half. A drive that began at their own 11 and has advanced now. You got to play man or sticky coverage. Don't drop back here. Internal pressure, someone's coming. Looks like Smith, he is coming. Pass complete, and Kelsey puts him in field goal range. Third and seven. Lofts it. Kelsey, who else? First down. They go with a bunch formation that allows Kelsey from the inside to get a little half pick there by Watson. You see him use his shoulder. They do it so well. It's subtle, but it's the difference in the game. Well, you're going to look at the great day you talked about with Kelsey. Look how long this is, Jim. This is one of the longest plays from start to finish. Look at this. All season for any team, and then the incredible job by Kelsey. How about the reach out? 9.78 seconds. He gets the protection. He goes long and on his back. To win in those man matchups sent a serious message. You're not beating us if you're playing man. And that was the reason why the Ravens thought they could win. They thought they had the matchups in their favor.